Now if you want to calculate compound interest without knowing the formula and if you know simple interest formula that is simple interest is equal to P and R divided by 100 where P stands for principal amount N stands for number of years stand for rate of interest so now we have to do is calculate simple interest for each year if it is a yearly compound interest first of all this is a simple interest program which we solved last time so we will edit in this only so first thing is we will change the name of that from simple interest to compound interest save it first. now the change is this we have to take another variable which will hold the value of compound interest here we are scanning three things first is principal amount second is number of years third is taking long and three because those are the bigger which can be more than 30 which are supports so long end is a better choice calculate any amount here we will need a loop loop is a thing which is used to run sub codes which are written under it for several amount of without again and again so here is what a loop of a loop looks like this closing and opening bases are the in this integer value that is r equal to the position for start for equal to number we here we here we are taking capital N for the for loop. it is not declared you can declare it here itself or you can in the upper declaration place I now there will be no hitting simple interest you already have to delete that N now it will be P into R divided by 100 now principal amount will be changing for each year for the calculation so that compound interest is generated for that we have to write P P which is the previous value of P the created interest simple interest that is SI semicolon your principal amount is changing CI will be again CI your chances of getting before anything goes wrong we just zero as less it to zero we want to display something called as component so here we'll have C that is compound interest which has to be displayed so we'll save it compile it there is no error there is no warning and run it center on thousand five years ten as rate of interest here we zero
now we will hundred enter hundred two years of interest we get compound interest to be Here what happens is these minor point values are missed by this. So we get an approximate answer point answer. We get using integers. Point cat values in which we have to change is the long will be replaced by Please book. Not LD. L is again for a. F will stand for a float. We have changed the LF LD to LF. Here it is from D to F, and now here again from LD to LF. Saving the values. Compiling it. running it amount was 100 2 years 5 which should be 10.25 amount is 1000 5 years rate of interest 10 we got 610.51 if you want to two decimal here you are dot 2 which thing we are telling this print it's after a print Six one zero dot five one. So you are after that.